welcome tonight to our prayers for tonight. We are grateful to the Lord that he has made it possible for us to be together again. I trust you've had a very good week so far. May his grace continually abide upon our lives is my prayer. We're praying tonight and tomorrow night about something we rarely think about. And because we don't think about it, we rarely talk about it. And because we rarely talk about it, we rarely pray about it. Yes, it is a reality that we need to constantly pray about. Maybe I should say, pray against. I'm talking on other than the issue of divination. Yes, divination. The theme for tonight is defeating destructive divinations. Defeating destructive divinations. Father, come gather together with us according to your promise that where two or three are gathered together in your name, there you are in the midst of them. Let's feel your presence on this prayer line tonight and bless each and every one of us in a very special way. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Defeating destructive divinations. Divinations? Yes. Divinations. What is the definition of divination? Well, as it relates to our focus of tonight, divination is simply the practice of seeking knowledge of the unknown by supernatural means. And in this case, we're talking about demonic means. The seeking out of this knowledge can be about a person, can be about a place, and can be about mm -hmm. a thing. So one can do divination on a person, about a place, and about a thing with the intention of knowing the best way to go about stealing, killing, and destroying that individual that is concerned. These are serious things, folks. I repeat, the information that is received by divination is used to strategize how to best attack a victim. Yes, that means divination and enchantment they go hand in hand. Divination is used to help find out the best way to put enchantment on a victim. So they go together. That was what Balak requested from Balaam in the book of Numbers. We know it because of what God said afterwards. God said in Numbers 23, 23, surely there is no enchantment against Jacob. But not only that, neither is there any divination against Israel. They walk hand in hand. Where you see enchantment, you will see divination. Where you see divination, you will see enchantment. They go hand in hand. Other words used synonymously with divination, according to the English dictionary, I was surprised to find this out, include fortune telling, include soothsaying, clairvoyance, magic, sorcery, and witchcraft. They are all brothers and sisters of the same evil family. In the course of your life, and in the course of my life, I was thinking about this yesterday. Only God knows where our names have been taken to and what has been worked against us. 
Yeah, only God. Only God knows when we get to heaven, we'll discover some things that will amaze us. Only God Almighty knows where our names have been taken to and what has been worked against us. The picture of a person can be used for divination. The clothing, especially that which is worn closest to the body, can be used for divination. The hair, the saliva, the shoes, the stockings, nail clippings, pillows, yeah, pillows, pillowcases, and kerchiefs, and kerchiefs, yes. You know, I had a musician, a gospel musician in Nigeria talk about how the handkerchief that he uses to wipe the, the sweat off his face, they always get missing wherever he goes to perform. <laughs> so he had a guy to keep an eye on his handkerchief. Somebody will come and take his handkerchief and go and use his glory. First for divination, then for enchantment. It's unbelievable. Money that your hand has touched can be used for divination. Body waste, yeah. Body fluids, yes. Pens and pencils, believe it or not. Not to talk about the sand of the footprints. The sand of your footprint. Let me tell you a story. There are, there are these people who worked in the forestry division many, many years ago, over 30 years ago in Africa. And they will drive their Jeep into the forest and uh, arrest those people who cut down uh, wood that they are not supposed to. Guess what these people did? They took the footprint of the Jeep that they were driving into the forest and the four tires exploded. Yes, it did. I saw it with my own eyes. These are serious things, people, when you talk about divination. You know, many times I look at those who are born and raised in the West, and I say, wow, you people don't know how blessed you are not to have to go through all the foolishness that we went through growing up in the hand of divination and in the hand of enchantment. Through what we are praying against tonight, many have been sent to an early grave. That's the truth. Many have been sent to an early grave through divination and enchantment. Others have been turned into people that live on earth as if they are dead people. Others have been given destructive habits. You see someone who just drinks and drinks and drinks. I, I, I came across somebody years ago right here in New York. All he does is sleep. He has never kept a job beyond three months because he will go to the job and he will just sleep off. There, there is no doctor who did not go for consultation. They just put that voodoo on him through divin... Only, and only God knows what they took from him that they used for the divination. But if this guy would just fall asleep and uh, he lost so many jobs, nobody wanted to hire him again. While others are given incurable money-sucking diseases that just wipe out the financial life of somebody. The least that the evil works do by the wickedness of divination and enchantment is too long to exhaust. But you know what happened one day? God caught a highly placed individual walking divination against his people. Yeah, it really happened in the Bible. The story is very revealing and the story is very educative in the book of Ezekiel 21.21. Yeah, Ezekiel 21.21. Let me read it to you. For the king of Babylon stood at the parting of the way. I want you to notice that. At the head of the two ways. I want you to notice that. To use divination. He made his arrows bright. He consulted with images. Note that. 
and he looked in the liver, liver that you eat for dinner. They use it for divination. And then in verse 22, at his right hand was the divination for Jerusalem. Aha! To appoint captains, to open the mouth of the mouth in the slaughter, to lift up the voice with shouting, to appoint battering rams against the gates, to cast a mount, and to build a fort. Every part of the warfare, they did it through divination. Now look at verse 23. And it shall be unto them as a false divination. Don't you love that? God said, let them divine as much as they want. It's going to be a false divination. To them that have sworn oaths, but he will call to remember the iniquity that they may be taken. I'm sorry for those who are doing divination and enchantment against you. Because after tonight, they're going to be arrested. So many things are contained in that passage that I just read. Let me take three minutes of our time and explain to you a couple of things about divination here. I really feel these preliminary things that I talk about, I need to talk about them so you can pray with understanding. Number one, there is a who in divining. All right, there is a who. Who is divining? In this case, who was the who? It was the king of Babylon. It is so revealing that people that are so high will also be involved with divination. You'll be surprised. Who is going where? In the night, in the day, to do divination against people. Number two, not only is there a who in divining, there is a who also in being divined against. In this case, it was a whole city of Jerusalem that they were doing the divination against. And the Israelites that were living there, the divination was against them. But it could be a person, it could be a place, it could be a thing. You know, I think about me all the time with what we do and with the kinds of prayers we pray. Only God knows. Only God knows where people take my name to. But thank God he's always there. Number three, there is also a where that divination takes place. In this case, the divination takes place at a road junction. I see them doing it in my neighborhood here. You will not believe it because we got a lot of foreigners that live around here. And I see divination even in the park, not far from my house. You will see divination everywhere and say, wow, Africa has come here or South, Af South America has come here. There is also a wear of divination. In this case, it was at a road junction, at the parting of the ways where two or three roads meet. You know, I see that in Africa all the time. You go to a three-way junction and you will see a sacrifice. It came from divination. It came from enchantment. In fact, let me not go there. Number four. In this passage, we also see that there is a what that is used for divination. There is a what that is used for divination. We are going to go after all those what's tonight, and we are going to set them on fire. So get ready to pray. In this case, they use bright arrows. You know why they use bright arrows? Arrows are for warfare. So they use bright arrows since it was warfare. He also used images. I don't know if it was the image of Jerusalem he used or it was the uh, image of the king of Jerusalem at that time, but they used images. And the Bible says they used liver for divination. That means there was a sacrifice that they sacrificed and they pulled the liver out of the stomach of the poor animal. Lord have mercy. Countless, countless, countless are the instruments of divination. Why? The reason is very simple. They wanted to conquer Jerusalem. They wanted to war against Jerusalem and the inhabitants of Jerusalem. Can I say something to you? If you're under warfare and you know where the warfare is coming from, don't be surprised if somebody's knocking on some doors and doing some sacrifices and going to some three-way junction at 12 midnight and they are making some incantations and enchantments against you and divinations against you. What is the best way to fight this person? These things are real. 
It was then in the book of Ezekiel. <laughs> it was at the time of Paul the Apostle. We'll get into that tomorrow. And it's still till today where you are. But you know what is so beautiful here? God saw it. Hallelujah. God saw it. He knew about it. And he called it a sin. You know what we're going to pray tonight? All those who are divining against you and enchanting against you, it will become sin against them. And it was rendered by God a false divination that will go nowhere. Wow. No traction whatsoever concerning this divination against Jerusalem. That's why I love what God said in Numbers 23, 23. Surely there is no enchantment against Jacob. Neither is there any divination against Israel. They're just wasting their time. As long as Israel was in good standing with God, Nothing they did walked against Israel. Look at what Isaiah said. I love this Isaiah 44, 25. And we're going to use this to seriously pray tonight. He says, he frustrateth the tokens of liars and he maketh diviners mad that turneth wise men backward and maketh their knowledge foolish. God made them mad. Why? Because their divination did not work. They wasted time to buy animal for sacrifice. They probably did a lot of other things. And everything came to zero upon zero. That is our warfare prayer tonight, people. Tomorrow night is even more serious. All the divinations against your life. All the divinations against my life. Will be rendered null and void. A falsehood that has no traction whatsoever against you and against me. Shall we go and pray now? I think it's about time. we got about 40 minutes to pray. That's plenty of time to do damage to demonic divinations. Let's go before God and thank him for allowing us to see yet another week safe and sound. Say, Lord, I bless you. Say, Lord, I worship you. Say, Lord, I adore you. Come on, bless his holy name for allowing you to see another week safe and sound. Thank him for his protection on you. Thank him for his protection on yours. We give God the praise. We give him the glory. We give him the honor. Thank you, Lord Jesus, uh, for allowing us to see yet another week. Hallelujah. And the week is even running to an end. Father, we thank you for your protection on us. We thank you for your hand upon our lives. Papa, glory be to your name. Honor be to your name. Dominion be to your name. Majesty be to your name. Thank him for our prayers of last week. Oh, on money failure. The response was huge. And the testimonies are numerous. Father, we just bless you. Father, we worship you. Father, we adore you. Father, we honor you. For the great things that you did here last week. Thank him for laying his hand on your finances and on my finances and protecting our finances from failure because money failure, not my portion. Father, we thank you because you've laid your hands upon the money, upon our prosperity, and it's not going to fail in the name of Jesus. Thank him because the seven causes of money failure will not move near your finances again after that prayer of last week. Father, we just praise you. Father, we just bless you. Father, we just worship you. We adore you. We honor you because our money will not fail because of those seven causes of failure. Maybe you are not with us last week. You can still go back and listen to the program all over again. Thank God for the theme of this week. Thank him because all destructive divinations against you are going to be rendered null and void. Father, I thank you even for my own life that after this week, in the name of Jesus and ongoing forward, all divinations, all divinations are going to be rendered null and void in the name of Jesus. I want you to thank God in advance that he's going to give us appropriate prayer points that we are going to use in praying tonight in the name of Jesus. 
Father, we thank you because appropriate prayer points will be given to us by your spirit, even as we pray, even as we call upon your holy name. I want to ask you tonight to pray that sin and unbelief will not render our prayers useless tonight. I want you to pray that the blood of Jesus will wash you, will cleanse you in the name of Jesus, that if there be any iniquity, if there be any sin, if there be any unrighteousness, the Lord in his mercy will look upon you. The Lord in his mercy will look upon me and cleanse us and purge us and purify us in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I want you to pray tonight that whatever I might have done today, yesterday, day before last, whatever I was, that will hinder my prayers. Oh God, I pray that the blood of Jesus will wash me. I pray that the blood of Jesus will cleanse me tonight in the name of Jesus every sin of omission, every sin of commission, every sin of unbelief, every sin of doubt, every sin of double-mindedness. Let them not hinder our prayers tonight, O Holy Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I want you to pray that we will have direct access into the Holy of Holies in the mighty, 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 mighty name of Jesus. I want you to pray that God will give you strength. God will give me strength to be able to pray tonight with great intensity in the name of Jesus, that you will be able to pray, I will be able to pray, and those who will listen and pray after we are done, we also be able to pray with great intensity in the mighty name of Jesus. I keep saying great intensity because it's the effectual, fervent, fiery, hot, and boiling prayers that avail much with God. I want you to just thank God because it will enable you to pray in the name of Jesus. But we need to pray to be where Israel was, that divination and enchantment did not work against them. You know why it did not work? I believe we prayed about this once or twice on this prayer line. They were in good standing before God. Say, oh Lord, say, give me grace to always be in good standing with you so that no divination can stand against Against me, no enchantment can walk against me in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. If you don't play with sin, if you don't play with prayer, no divination, no enchantment can ever, ever, ever walk against you. Don't play with sin, don't play with prayer. So I want you to pray tonight, oh Lord, give me the grace at all times to be in good standing with God in the name of Jesus. If I'm in good standing with God, there's nothing that man can do to me. There's nothing that devils can do to me. Oh God, give us grace this evening, oh Lord, to always be in good standing with heaven so that no one on this earth born of a woman will be able to do divination and enchantment against any one of us in the name of Jesus. I wanted to plead with God tonight, say, oh Lord, let the doors close, all open doors in the name of Jesus, all open doors in my life that may cause divination to prosper against me, Papa, shut them tight tonight, shut them tight tonight, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Father God in heaven, close firmly all open doors in my life that may cause divination to prosper against me in the name of Jesus. And if divination is prospering against me right now, I pray that you will shut every door through which they come in and go out in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Papa, shut the doors for me, O oh God. I give you the permission to shut the door and throw the key away in the name of Jesus. I will not tamper with the keys. I will not go open the door in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I want you to pray tonight. One of the first things that divination powers do is to weaken your spiritual life because once your spiritual life is weakened, then they can come in and steal and kill and destroy. Say, my father, divination powers, divination powers that weaken spiritual authority. Let them be destroyed from my life in the name of Jesus. Every weakness to my spiritual life, oh God, every weakness to my spiritual authority, oh God, destroy them for me, destroy them for me, destroy them for me tonight. Come on, open your mouth and pray wherever you are tonight. Divination powers are weakened spiritual authority. Divination powers are weakened spiritual power. Be destroyed in my life. Be destroyed from my life, be perished from my life, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I want you Lord God to just strengthen me spiritually, come on let us pray together tonight, that heaven will 
just strengthen your spiritual life uh, in the name of Jesus. You know how they say, oh, that man is stronger. You know how they say, ah, that woman is stronger. I want you to pray that I shall be among the number in the name of Jesus. I shall be numbered among those that it can be said of them that they are strong. Say, oh Lord, make me strong in the Lord and in the power of your might. Father, make me strong in the Lord and in the power of your might. Make me strong in living right, in praying right, in walking right, in talking right. In the name of Jesus, that no divination will be able to walk against me, Holy Father. We ask you that you will do that for us on this prayer line, even before we start praying against destructive divinations, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Papa, just have your way among us tonight. Divination powers that weaken spiritual authority, the divination powers, the weakened spiritual power. We pray that they be destroyed tonight among us. They be destroyed in our lives tonight in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray, oh Lord, disappoint them, disappoint them, disappoint them. Come on, pray, 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 pray. Please pray, please pray, please pray. Say, Lord, disappoint anyone, anyone going around to do divination against me and to do divination about me in the name of Jesus and to walk enchantment concerning me. Papa, disappoint Disappoint them everywhere they go. In the name of Jesus, disappoint them everywhere they go. Come on, open your mouth and let's talk to God tonight. Disappoint anyone going around to do divination concerning me, O oh God. To find out knowledge that they cannot find out naturally. To find out information that they cannot find out naturally. Papa, disappoint them. Disappoint them anywhere they go. Disappoint them everywhere they go. In the name of Jesus. Anyone and everyone I pray tonight. Going around, walking around and paying fees for divination against me. I reject it in the name of Jesus. I pray you will disappoint them, disappoint them, disappoint them, disappoint them. As they go around, come on, open your mouth and pray with me tonight, please. Say, oh Lord, make it impossible. Make it impossible. Say, Lord, make it impossible. Come on, say, oh Lord, make it impossible. Say it again. Say, Lord, make it impossible. Say, make it impossible for them to see what they want to see. Make it impossible for them to get what they want to get. Make it impossible for them to have what they want to have. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord, whoever is going around for divination against me, oh Lord. They want to see something. They want to get something. They want to have something. Say, oh Lord, block them, block them, block them, block them, block them. Make it impossible for them to see what they want to see. Make it impossible for them to get what they want to get. Make it impossible for them to have what they want to have. They are after after something, they will not get it. In the name of Jesus, can I ask you to make this declaration? Say, you who are making divinations against me, what you want to have, you will not have them. What you want to get, you will not get them. What you want to see, you will not see them. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I want you to pray that when they do divination against you, the blood of Jesus will show up. I remember a brother that they went and did divination about. They put water down. We are going to talk more about that tomorrow. We are going to pray about that tomorrow because many times divination is connected to water spirits and they put the water down and his face was supposed to show in the water. When they called his name, the whole water turned into blood. Hallelujah! Say, Lord, I plead the blood of Jesus against the powers of divination. Walking against my life. I plead the blood of Jesus against them. Make it impossible for them to see me when they want to see me. To take from me what they want to take from me. To have from me what they want to have in my hand. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh God of possibilities. Make it impossible for them to see what they want to see. To get what they want to get. To have what they want to have. In the name of Jesus. Say I decree tonight. Diviners will not have their ways in my life. Enchanters will not have their way in my life. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord, 
everyone born of a woman uh, doing divination against me uh, at any road crossing uh, or anywhere for that matter uh, stumble and fall stumble and fall stumble and fall uh, stumble and fall stumble and fall stumble and fall uh, stumble and fall stumble and fall stumble and fall uh, say anyone born of a woman uh, doing divination against me oh lord uh, at any road crossing uh, at any point at any place on this under this sun uh, oh lord any where for that matter, anyone that is doing divination against me, oh Lord, Papa, let them stumble and fall, let them stumble and fall, let them stumble and fall. In the name of Jesus, you shall stumble. All divinations and all diviners, you shall stumble and you shall fall. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord, my God, wherever they have taken my name to for evil, mercy of God, answer for me, mercy of God, answer for me, mercy of God, answer for me wherever they take my name to for evil old divination wherever my name is taken to for divination mercy of god answer for me O god mercy of god answer for me O spirit of god mercy of god answer for me O holy spirit wherever whenever wherever they have taken my name to O god for evil come on open your mouth and pray in the name of jesus usually they go somewhere i know i know i know there are many places in our world where they do these things, where they specialize in these things. But I want you to pray the mercy answer for me in the name of Jesus. Mercy of God answer for me in the name of Jesus. Mercy of God answer for me wherever they take my name to, wherever they take my husband's name to, wherever they take my children's name to, oh God, under this heaven. Mercy of God answer. Mercy of God answer, mercy of God answer, in the name of Jesus answer for us, O oh God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. There is a spirit called the spirit of divination. Did you know that? We will be praying about that too. Please don't miss tomorrow night. But for tonight, let's just pray this. Say spirits of divination. Come on, open your mouth. Say spirits of divination. Working for them against me. Begin to walk against them. Hallelujah. Say every spirit of divination working for anyone against me any spirit of enchantment working for anyone against me begin to walk against them from tonight begin to walk against them from this minute begin to walk against them from this hour every spirit of divination every spirit of enchantment walking against me O oh lord let him begin to turn around and walk against O oh lord in the name of jesus those who are walking their wickedness in the name of jesus can we pray prayer tonight. Uh, say whoever is standing, uh, consulting with images. Uh, that was what the king of Babylon did. Oh, that's not my own idea. Oh, say whoever is standing, uh, consulting with images, uh, consulting with liver, consulting with sacrifice uh, against my life. Uh, say, Father, hold it as iniquity against them uh, like you did against the king of Babylon. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, say whoever anywhere stands up against me, O oh God, and consulting with images, consulting with levers, consulting with idols, consulting with sacrifice against my life, against my finances, against my marriage, against my progress. O oh Lord, hold it as iniquity against them in the name of Jesus. I'm hearing in my spirit that there's somebody on this prayer line, you took a stand, you took an unpopular stand about with your in laws and they are angry with you and they are going to do divination i want you to pray tonight lord hold this as iniquity against them if you know their names mention their names mr so and so mrs so and so whoever it is that i took a stand it is your home that you took a stand you have a right to take a stand for yourself but they are angry they are going to do divination say oh lord hold it as iniquity against them hold it as iniquity against him hold it as iniquity against her in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ whoever is running from pillar to post because you stood your ground in your church you stood your grand family and now they are going around to witches and wizards and say look at what pastor did look at what evangelist did look at what bishop did let this happen to him let that happen to him say oh Lord whatever they have divine to happen to me let it backfire on them let it backfire with fire. Let it backfire with shame. Let it backfire with destruction. In the name of Jesus.
Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say whatever they are sending my way, let it turn around and go back to them. Whatever the divination is, let it turn around, oh God, and explode in their faces. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I hope you are praying where you are tonight. I'm getting, I'm getting fired up here. And we are not even halfway through the prayer yet. Say I cancel. Say I cancel. Come on, let's cancel them. Say I cancel. <clears throat> every animal sacrifice. Mm. That's a very, very, very common phenomenon. Every animal sacrifice uh, that is used for divination against me, uh, I cancel them with the sacrifice of Jesus Christ. Uh, they shall not stand. Uh, they must not stand. Uh, they will not stand. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, every, animal, every animal sacrifice uh, that is used for divination against me, uh, that is used for enchantment against me, O oh Lord, uh, I cancel them uh, with the precious blood of Jesus. Uh, I cancel them uh, with the precious blood of Jesus. Say they shall not stand. Say they will not stand. Say they must not stand. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. I hope you are praying. With, don't just look at my mouth. Oh, open your mouth and pray too. In the name of Jesus. If you don't know what to pray, just pray for me. In the name of Jesus. Say I cancel every animal sacrifice for, that is used for divination against this bishop who is leading this prayer. They shall not stand against him. If you don't pray for yourself. You might as well pray for me. In the name of Jesus Christ, uh, say fire, 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 fire. We need to do some fire burning tonight. Uh, say, oh Lord, uh, say set fire on all images. Uh, set fire on all images. Uh, set fire on voodoo dolls. Uh, do you know what they call voodoo dolls? Uh, oh my goodness. Uh, go and Google it. Uh, you will see what I mean about voodoo dolls. Uh, they put pins in them in divination. They put pins in voodoo dolls. Uh, if they put pain in the head, the head will be pain in that person. The head will be hot in that person. If they put pain in the stomach, the stomach will be hot in that person. I want you to pray for fire. Everybody say fire. Everybody say fire. Everybody say fire. Fire all images. All images that are used for divination. All voodoo dolls that are used for divination. All paraphernalia that are used for divination. Papa set them on fire. Papa set them on fire. Papa set them on fire. Fire. Papa set them on fire wherever they may be tonight, wherever they may be this morning, wherever they may be this hour. Every image, every image of myself, every picture of myself. <laughs> Only God knows where your picture is. You know, they pick it up online. They pick it up on your Facebook page and they go and use it for divination. Say, oh Lord, all my images, all my pictures in the wrong places, in the name of Jesus, that are being used for divination tonight, expire. Catch fire, burn off in the name of Jesus. All voodoo dolls that they have put pins in, all images that they have tied up. When they tie the image up, they tie you up too. Say every divination that has used images concerning me, that has used my pictures, that have used my family pictures, that have used my children's picture. Oh Lord, destroy them by fire tonight. Oh Lord, destroy them by fire tonight. I sure do hope you are praying where you are tonight. Uh, this is not something you just sit back uh, and listen to. No, 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 no. I want you to pray uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, oh Lord, let them choke in their incantations. Uh, oh Lord, let them choke in their enchantments. Uh, come on, open your mouth and pray against that uh, while they are doing their incantations, uh, while they are doing their enchantments. Uh, let them choke in the name of Jesus. Uh, blood of Jesus, choke them uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I want you to pray tonight, pray tonight, pray tonight neither whatever, 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 whatever is connected to your body uh, that is being used for divination against you uh, shall not prosper in their hands. In the name of Jesus, somebody put a big fire on Facebook. I love that, my friend. I want you to pray tonight. Whatever it is that is connected to my body uh, that is being used for divination against me, uh, you shall not prosper. My stockings, wherever you are, in the name of Jesus, my underwears, 
wherever you are. In the name of Jesus, many of you have had clothes that are mysteriously missing after some foolish person visited your house and they have gone to use it for divination and is working against your progress. Say whatever in the name of Jesus, whatever has touched my body, whatever is part of my body that has been used for divination right now, catch fire where you are, catch fire where you are. You shall not prosper in their hands. You shall not prosper in their covens. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, are you praying where you are or you are just murmuring? I want you to open your mouth wide and talk to God. Whatever is connected to my body, you live with this man. He took whatever he took. He took it wherever he took it to, but it shall be useless tonight. It shall be of none effect in their hands tonight. Say my pictures, say my apparels in their possession. I command you not to respond to any evil, evil divination, to any evil divination. Respond not, respond not, respond not, respond not. In the name of Jesus, all my pictures, all my apparels, all my nail clippings, all my spittle, all my hair that is in the wrong places, being used for divination right now. I command you to be of no use in the hand of those who have them. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I want us to pray against evil summon, evil summon, evil summon. Say, oh Lord, whoever summons me, whoever calls my name at any divination spot, let thunder, fire, and smoke, and lightning, let them answer for me in the name of Jesus. Whoever summons me, oh God, whoever calls my name in the middle of the night, in the name of Jesus, while they are in any divination spot and they want to put divination and enchantment against me, calling my name, let thunder answer for me, let lightning answer for me, let fire answer for me, let smoke answer for me. Come on, open your mouth and pray tonight in the name of Jesus. These divinations are destructive. You'll find out tomorrow. I want you to pray tonight. Let's pray against one walk of divination. In the name of Jesus, say he slept and he died. She slept and she died in his sleep, in her sleep because of divination and enchantment. Say it shall not be my portion. Say it shall not be my portion. Say it shall not be my portion. I will sleep in peace. I will wake up in peace night after night until I, it's time for me to go meet the Lord. Father God, it would never be said that it was a divination and enchantment in the middle of the night that took my life. He slept and died in his sleep because of destructive divination and enchantment. They shall not be my portion. 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 He slept and he died. She slept and she died. The little baby slept and died because of destructive divination and enchantment in the sleep. Papa, it shall not be my portion. Come on, say it shall not be my portion. It shall not be the portion of anybody in my family. It shall not be the portion of the old. It shall not be the portion of the young. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight in the name of Jesus. You know what the Bible says? The Bible says, God, <laughs> in the book of Isaiah, he says, God makes diviners mad. Mm. He makes them mad. I want you to pray tonight. Say, oh Lord, you who specializes in making diviners mad, call him by his name. It's his specialty to make diviners mad. Say, oh Lord, frustrate their plans, overturn their sacrifices, make their knowledge foolish in the name of Jesus. Say, my father, you specialize in making diviners mad. I want you to arise for me tonight. Oh Lord, frustrate their plans in the name of Jesus. All plans of diviners and enchanters frustrate their plans, overturn their sacrifices, make their knowledge foolish. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I want you to pray that the Lord's anger and judgment will be on anyone that is seeking divination against you or any of yours. Say, oh Lord God Almighty, against my son, against my daughter, against my husband, against my wife, in the name of Jesus, whoever did does divination against them. Papa, let those people see your anger. Let those people see your judgment.
judgment. Let those people see your fury in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Not only those who are seeking enchantment, but those who are helping them. Both those who go for consultation and those that they consult. Judgment of God, anger of God. Let it be upon them in the name of Jesus. Say from tonight, from tonight, from tonight. Maybe it's this morning for your own time. Say all consultations against me must end in regret, must end in lamentations. In the name of Jesus, say all consultations against me. Let it end in regret. Let it end with lamentation. Let them weep. Let them cry. I want you to pray. Whatever they do, divinations against me for. Oh Lord, let it be their portion. In the name of Jesus, whatever they want to see happen to me, let it happen to them before they leave the place of divination. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, say all consultations against me, oh, all consultations against me and mine, you must end with regret. You must end with lamentation. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, the next prayer is hot, 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 hot. Say, oh Lord, make things hot for those divining against my life. Say it, open your mouth. Say, oh Lord, make things hot. Make things hot. Make things hot. Make things hot. Make things hot for those who are using divination against my life. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray this prayer. Say, the ground they are standing, turn it into fire. The clothes they are wearing, turn it into fire. The air they are breathing, turn it into fire, 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 fire everywhere until they let me go. In the name of Jesus, the bed that they sleep on, turn it into fire. The blanket that they put on themselves, turn it into fire. The water that they drink, turn it into fire until they lose me and let me go. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, oh Lord God, make things hot for them that are warring against me, O Lord. The ground they are standing, let it be fire. The clothes they are wearing, let it be fire. The air they are breathing, let it be fire. The bed they are sleeping, let it be fire, 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 fire. Fire, fire, fire on all workers of divination against me and mine. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Say, O Lord, everything they are seeking against my life through divination, let it become their portion. One hundredfold. Open your mouth and pray tonight. Say everything that they are seeking against me through divination. Let it become their portion. Let it become their portion, not my portion. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Can I ask you to pray this prayer? Very important. I need it. You need it. Say whatever I'm going through right now, in the name of Jesus. You don't know. You pray this prayer just in case. Whatever my husband is going through right now, whatever my wife is going through right now, whatever my son, my daughter is going through right now, that is as a result of divination uh, and, and, and wickedness. Uh, loving Father, reverse it for me tonight. Uh, reverse it, cancel it. Reverse it, cancel it. I can hear you praying. I'm happy you are praying. Uh, say whatever I'm going through right now in that you never know. If you're a minister here tonight, uh, say whatever my church is going through right now, whatever my ministry is going through right now, whatever my business is going through right now, whatever my academic life is going through right now, that is as a result of destructive divination. Loving Father, whatever my plans are going through right now, that is as a result of destructive divination. Papa, reverse them for me, reverse them for me, reverse them for me, reverse them for me. Say I decree and I declare. Come on, say it. Say I decree and I declare. No divination power shall succeed at making me die unfulfilled. Hey. Mm. Mm. Do you know how many people are in the cemetery that died unfulfilled? They never fulfilled their mission on earth because of divinations, because of enchantments. I want you to decree tonight. Say no, div no divination power. Say no divination power shall succeed at making me die unfulfilled in the name of Jesus. When I lay down my head and die, 
I will have been fulfilled in the name of Jesus. Say, I decree it in the name of the Father. Say, I decree it in the name of the Son. Say, I decree it in the name of the Holy Ghost. No divination power, no matter how strong, no matter how well worked it is, shall succeed at making me die unfulfilled in the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus. Let's pray against their arrows. Let's pray against their arrows because the Bible tells us in that book of Ezekiel, that they had arrows as part of their divination. Say arrows from divination backfire, backfire, and return to senders. Arrows of divination backfire and return to sender. Guns. Hey, have you ever been shot in your dreams before? Say guns and arrows, spears, whatever instrument of divination, dogs, masquerades, whatever machetes, whatever instrument of divination, return to your sender and go and afflict them in the name of Jesus. Go and afflict them, not me, in the name of Jesus. All chains, all shackles, all demonic ropes, in the name of Jesus, against my ministry, against my marriage, against everything that is mine, I command you to go back to sender and afflict them like they want me afflicted, in the name of Jesus, say strange powers, mm strange powers holding me down. Let me go tonight by fire in the name of Jesus. Every strange divination power that is holding me down. Let me go by fire tonight. Let me go by fire tonight. Loose me and let me go tonight. Loose me and let me go tonight. We got just seven more minutes. Say strange divination forces holding me down. Holding me down from making progress. Holding my church down from making progress. Holding my business down from making progress. Holding my children down from making progress. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. I shall be fulfilled. My children shall be fulfilled. My business shall be fulfilled. My, 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 my ministry shall be fulfilled. Visitation, divination forces. You be destroyed by fire. Let me go by fire. In the name of Jesus. Can I ask you to pray against limitations? Divinations. Promoting limitations. Divinations, divinations, promoting limitations, expire and die in the name of Jesus. Divinations, promoting limitations in my life, expire and die in the name of Jesus. I hope you are praying, oh, limitations, 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 divinations, promoting limitations in my life, expire and die. I can tell you stories of people who are doing well in business and then they are own blood brother, their own blood sister will arise and put limitation on that business. If they made money, will the family not enjoy? Some people are wicked. Say every divination promoting limitations, every divination promoting limitations in any area of my life, expire and die, expire and die, expire and die in the name of Jesus. Listen to the next prayer point. I want us to pray it. Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, this next prayer point. Say every divination that wants to keep me unused, every divination that wants to keep me uncelebrated, unaccomplished, undiscovered, every divination that wants to keep me, oh God, unused, uncelebrated, unaccomplished, undiscovered, die by fire. In the name of Jesus, Papa, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, destroy them tonight. Any effect of any wicked divination that wants to keep me unused, unused by God, unused by man, uncelebrated, unaccomplished, undiscovered. You have gifts, 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 gifts that can bring you before kings, but you are undiscovered. Oh Lord, whatever it is, divination that they have gone to do under the waters, divination that they have gone to do in the rocks, divination that they have gone to do in the heavenlies, so that I will never, never be celebrated, so I will never, never be accomplished, so I will never, never be discovered. Oh Lord, let them be destroyed, let them die. You know, I watched a video today on Facebook. It shocked me. It was an interview about a father 
whose wife took the children away and the father went and did a divination that as those children are not useful to him, they will not be useful to this woman. And he took their glory and buried their glory. Say so every divination that has in anger buried my glory. Oh Lord, let them die, let them die, let them die, let them die. Wherever they have taken my name to, oh God, so that I will not rise. I will not be celebrated. I will not be accomplished. I will not be discovered with all the gifts and anointing. Oh Lord, let them die one by one. Let them die everyone. Whatever they have collected about me, I'm buried. Oh Lord, you are the resurrection and the life. Exhume every demonic burial of my potentials. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. And the father, they interviewed him on Facebook. Oh, and he said, it's true, I did it. I did it to punish my wife. I didn't know it would affect my children and the children now cannot go anywhere it was where they went to pray that they told them ah your father has buried all your glory out of anger i want you to pray tonight whoever has been angry with me and has buried what will make me have glory on earth papa reverse 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 it i want you to tell the lord let me be celebrated let me be used let me be accomplished let me be discovered let my light begin to shine let my star begin to rise and shine in the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord, bulldoze them. Bulldoze my way. Say, oh Lord, bulldoze them. Bulldoze my way. All roadblocks, all barriers, all hindrances that diviners have placed in my way, that enchanters have placed in my way. Papa, bulldoze them. All the barriers, all the hindrances in the name of Jesus. All the hindrances, all the barriers, all the roadblocks that the diviners are put in my way. Papa, bulldoze them out of my way in the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord, overturn them, overturn them, overturn them, overturn them. Say, Papa, overturn them, overturn them, overturn them in the name of Jesus. Say, every spirit, every spirit. We got one more minute and 30 seconds. Say, every spirit. Mm that they have commissioned in their divination. Let those spirits be pursued by angels out of my way. Come on, pray this prayer. We got two more prayer points. Say all spirits that have been commissioned in their divination, in their enchantment, Pursue them, angels of God. Pursue them, angels of God. Pursue them in the name of Jesus. Every demonic power, every demonic personality, every demonic spirit that have been commissioned against me in their divination, that have been commissioned against me in their enchantment, I must come alive. You know, and look at many of us in the West, many of us in America, many of us in Germany, many of us in Europe, and I look at many, many people, they cannot accomplish anything because the powers, they follow them here and they cannot achieve anything. And those who want to leave Africa, those who want to leave the Caribbean, they have tied them down. They cannot move out. I want you to pray tonight. Whatever has me tied, whatever has me restrained, break in the name of Jesus. Whatever has me restrained to, be, to remain single, whatever has me restrained to remain penniless, break and be destroyed in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight, every divination that has been poured on the ground for as a libation. Did you hear what I said? Every divination that has been poured on the ground to keep me down on the ground. Every divination that has been poured on the ground to keep me down on the ground, be destroyed by fire, be destroyed by fire, be destroyed by fire. The ground that swallowed you up, me spill you out in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I want you to finally pray that every divination against you will be false divination. Every divination from now on against me will be false divination. It shall not prosper. Every divination against me shall not prosper. In the name of Jesus. And the one that has prospered up till now will expire this very second. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I feel in my spirit. You 
you still need to go back and pray this prayer over and over and over again. But I want to bless you even as we go off the air today in the name of Jesus. I bless you in the name of the Father. I bless you in the name of the Son. I bless you in the name of the Holy Ghost. May every prayer that you are prayed against divination and enchantment, may they be answered. May they, may they be given to you. May you see a change. May you come out from under the chain of divination from now on. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. And amen. And amen. And amen. And amen. So I wish you had a grace as we break for the evening. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen and amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Please join us tomorrow again at 7. Until then, good night.